often but the reason why I'm here is I'm trying to pick out a white couch I just sold my gray one because it didn't really go with the vibe that I was going for in my room or my living room so I'm looking for a white one I'm here to test out the comfort level of the sofas because I can't really tell online so yeah and also get some food <laughs> for this last time I came here but I couldn't find it but I'm gonna get this for Junie it's such a cute little bed it's supposed to be for kids like the doll bed and it looks like this but I think it's perfect for a little cat bed what do you reckon? wait what's this? oh this one's very deep Shots for Junie. I bought this on a website called Mike Neko. I don't know why, but they don't notify me when the thing is delivered. So I don't know how long this has been behind the rocks outside my house. Last time when I got the banana house thing for Junie, it was behind the rocks for ages as well until i got another delivery and i think that delivery guy saw my parcels and left a note telling me to check yes i got these bowls for jenny from this brand called bridge dog it's from korea but i bought it on this website based in Melbourne because they stopped them and I think it's so cute this baby blue color they had like a whole range of colors like lilac purple yellow but I just liked this baby blue and I got a another bowl in the baby blue so it's a whole set Hi guys, it's Sunday and today I'm going to the furniture gallery. I've been on a hunt for a new couch. I went to Ikea on Thursday? Friday? Oh, on Friday. And I couldn't find anything so I was pretty disheartened. But I was scrolling through Instagram and I saw this couch that I really liked and they were also located in Perth. So we're going to go have a look. I'm actually pretty paranoid about buying furniture online firstly because I can't test out whether it's comfy or what it looks like in real life and also because I'm just paranoid about spending like a lot of money online at once so and also you have a long wait time when it's online because it's usually back ordered so yeah I'm gonna go and check out the couch I DM'd them yesterday because they have three showrooms and we're gonna go to the one in Osborne Park and I didn't show you guys but I also got a parcel the other day and it's from seven days again and I got these gradient sweatpants it's from the new collection I just think this gradient is super nice and I also got the new summer set that I don't think I'm gonna be wearing yet because it's pretty cold This is not the couch I was looking at because it was extra expensive, but I kind of like this one. Oh, yes. You like yes. it? Sure. But it's expensive. No, this is the one. Yeah. That's what you look like. Your masterpiece. 
I just bought my couch. This, this huh? time, technically, your couch only cost you. What, taking away the amount I sold the other one? Yeah. Because that's what, that's what I was thinking about. Like, we can save more. They're both comfortable couches. I want to make these cold noodles so I also put some soba noodles somewhere down here and use some chicken breast I have in my fridge hello hello some carrots and cucumber they're not as fine as the tutorial I watched did it but should be good enough and also some eggs on the side to put on top of the noodles once I cook them this is the finished product it doesn't look as appetizing as I want it to be, but still pretty good. Mm. 
morning guys it's 7 a.m i just got a call from the furniture gallery that they're about 10 minutes away i was expecting them to come around at like nine or afterwards because they usually take ages but they're almost here and i just moved the furniture around this is where i want the couch to be and they're gonna come through this door That's my new couch. It's a little over 12 now. I had a little nap after the couch guys came and set the couch up. And I just made some lunch. And today is to kind of clean up my room and my living room. But I also have a bunch of work to do. So I'm going to do some work first. Because cleaning takes a long time. And I feel like if I start with cleaning first, I'll take the whole day. And be really guilty at night. Because I haven't got any actual work done. Yeah. I'm going to watch my lectures in the meantime. And then prepare for my tutorials though tomorrow. I usually prepare them on Monday, but I didn't have time yesterday. Good morning, it's 11 o'clock right now and I have class at 12, so I'm gonna get going. I am just wearing a grey crop top and some white jeans and I was going to wake up earlier to shoot a video but I slept in so that's that. Hopefully I'll get it done tomorrow. I've been saying that every single day but on Monday I had my internship and on Tuesday I woke up super early for my couch and then I took a nap and then it didn't happen. So hopefully, hopefully I'll get that done. But yeah, let's go. I'll be home soon. Bye bye. I'm bringing a water bottle with me today because I feel like I haven't been getting in enough water. This used to not be a problem for me because I drink like two or three liters of water a day. But I feel like I've been drinking a lot of chai time. Even though I have fruit tea only, I still think that's kind of bad for you. So just going up. Try and drink more water again. And your father's red, not six four. Right on the window, eyes fucking up. Lie on the side and sink inside my soul. Like any other day, we tend to go. I think you notice I talk. I bought a chicken dim sum and two of these on your three triangles again because I just love these. Got the teriyaki salmon and the teriyaki chicken. you are 